Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Oh the Hermanity. So, Lost Vein Melee has finally dropped. And I know it's been a little while since I made a Seven Deadly Sins video. Uh, I just been busy, been working on my other channel, Scott Herman Fitness. For those of you who are into fitness and you haven't checked it out, make sure you do. It's my, actually my bigger channel. I have 2.4 million subscribers there. It's been a lot of work, and I've been putting a, a lot more work into my training as well because I might have some some things coming up I can't quite talk about. But you know, I, I, I did pull on the Derriere banner, I didn't pull her, I didn't really do too many summons on it, I figured she would come back. I had a strong enough team to do the boss battle anyways on my own without her, I just subbed her out for Red Escanor. So I think I went Red Merlin, Red Escanor, Red Jericho, uh, and Red Gother, and I was able to beat all three no problem, and I wasn't really going for the highest score anyway, so whatever. Plus, I knew Lost Vane Melee was around the corner, and I wanted to save uh, diamonds for him, and of course... Dokkan's been off the chats lately, and yeah, anyways, we're gonna jump in this banner. We got the new Las Vegas Melee. We got the new Fraudron that we can pull. He looks pretty badass. His armor looks like him in his demon form. So we're just gonna jump right in. I think we're gonna hit that draw ticket first, and then go into some diamonds. I like tickets. Tickets for me are usually pretty lucky. All right, got a little stick animation. I was hoping for a little Escanor sun action, but no sun, no no hand clap. So we're just jumping in, I guess, on a normal a normal ticket summon right now. It's all good though. Can still make some magic happen. We got like medium demon demon face melee. Oh, and we're getting knocked back, and we're toast. Oh, it was only a single. Didn't realize that. No, no wonder why it sucked. <laughs> Well, we ain't drawing again. Let's hit those diamonds. And the cool thing about this, too, is you, as you do the diamond summons, as long as you hit the 900 points, you're going to get a Lost Vein Melee anyway. So if we can get our dupes from diamonds and then pick up that last one, I mean, that would probably be the best case scenario, right? Because then we would have super attack increase uh, at the end. And we're getting snacked around uh, quite hardcore right now. That's okay. We can still save it. Let's see if we can. We can still save it. Mm, I don't think we're going to save it. Nope. <laughs> All right. Not too bad. I mean, out of the gate, I guess. You know, never really expect fire on your first summon. Second summon, though, that's when the fire comes. For sure. Get that hand back. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right. This feels like a Lost Vein Melee right here. This feels like a Lost Vein Melee and Fraudron in the same multi. That's what it really feels like. Dude, I did a multi summon the other day on the Fairy Banner. I, had, I bought five tickets because I was bored, right? And I pulled three SSIs in those five tickets. I was blown away. I didn't need any of them. It was like two red Halbrooms um, and, a, and an Elizabeth. But still, three SSIs out of a five draw summon is pretty incredible. And if I didn't need the red Halbrum, I would have been pumped because he's beast mode. But I don't need him. I think I probably have like ten copies of him right now that I'm saving for for the to buy some coin with some coins later. And I'm on the fence because I only need one more dupe of Red Escanor to max him out. But I don't know if I want to buy the final copy with Platinum Coin. Because I feel like as soon as I do, I'm going to pull a Red Escanor off of another banner like immediately. So I feel like I'm going to wait on my Red Escanor. Oh, wow. Are you serious? How many diamonds did I spend to get one copy of Esterosa? And now he shows up casually on the Las Vegas Melee banner? Of course he does. Why wouldn't he? Of course he does. That's okay. And it's Red Esterosa. Nice. All right. Looks like we just boosted the super attack. Damn, it's going to take a while to get. So you basically have to spend 900 diamonds to get that Las Vegas Melee. I was hoping you'd get at least maybe two points per, per diamond spent, but it don't look like it. Oh, we're hitting that hand back again. Dude, I'm actually really happy with the Esterosa. If I would have gotten an SSI that I absolutely didn't need at this point, I'd be pissed. 
We're only at the half anniversary, and I'm already pulling way too many platinum coins that I don't even need. All right, we're breaking in the middle. That's fine. We can still go beast mode on the on these summons. Damn, I was hoping for two. Hoping for two. There will be no fake outs on this summon. So how have you guys been? How have you been doing on seven deadly sins? Oh shit! What do you get here? Oh nice. Oh wait, that is Las Vegas Meliodas. I was so thrown off. <laughs> I didn't even realize what happened. Damn, there we go. All right. <laughs> it was like the weirdest look of confusion probably ever in a Las Vegas Meliodas summon. Because I was talking to you guys. <laughs> the Boar Hat Tavern outfit threw me off for a second. Because obviously when he when he um, transcends to, the, to UI from SSI, he has on his Las Vegas Meliodas um, iron suit. Oh, beast mode. All right, then. No, that was easy. <laughs> oh, it's that positive energy still resonating from my 8 LIs on the last Dokkan video live stream, guys. By the way, how insane was that? That was pretty insane, right? And I'm going to be doing some streaming tonight, too. Uh, I got lots of events that I need to work on. I already Dokkan awakened my LI Majin Buu and my STI Vegito. So I'll have those units ready to go. And there's your boy. Las Vegas Meliodas. Third summon. Boom. Ah, let's keep going. Who cares, right? We're here to get dupes, baby. Ooh. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. He's going to pick it up at least. Or we'll know in about two seconds if it's going to be a good multi. I want to get at least one Escanor summon off these Maltese. Just one. And toast. Next one's going to be Escanor. 123. Only 877 to go. <laughs> Damn, that's, that's rough. All right, flashy eyes. No Escanor. That's okay. So, so far we pulled Las Vegas Meliodas and Esterosa. That's friggin' beast mode. That's, that's like really good summits. Out of what, 130 diamonds? That's what I'm talking about. This is how summits should go. It's a nice little, little casual conversation. Albion's getting his face blown off. And then Las Vegas Meliodas shows up. You know, maybe we'll let Fraldrin join the party now. Now that we got Las Vegas, Meliodas, we got Estorosa. I feel like, I feel like Fraldrin, Fraldrin can join now. I wouldn't be too upset if I pulled a Fraldrin instead of my first uh, dupe of Las Vegas, Meliodas. I think I'd be okay. Let's see if we can make it happen. Give at a point right now in this game where, like, before, I could never get enough SSI pendants. And now I have, like, tons of them. Whoa! What? Oh, that's Las Vegas Meliodas number two! We're gonna keep going! <laughs> oh, yeah! That was pretty beast. Dude, we're gonna... This is gonna be the Red Escanor banner all over again. We're gonna come out with like all the dupes we need before we even get to that 900 diamonds point, right? Like seriously. I should just hit skip at this point. There's no doubles in here. All right, there's your boy. Oh wow, look at his, his coin has little spiky edges. That's pretty cool. Little spiky edges on that coin. All right, it's settled. We're just gonna be pulling Las Vegas Meliodas on this video. Just some some casual, you know what, that's crap. Let's get to the next one. I knew that was gonna be nothing. Might as well at this point, if it looks like it's gonna be trash, just assume it is, cause look, now we have blinky eyes, crisscrossing stop patterns, hand back blowing, double SSI, Double Las Vegas Meliodas is about to hit us. Which would be sick. Maybe let's do a little bicep bomb luck real quick. There we go. Alright, Meliodas. We're gonna break in the middle. Alright, that's fine. I mean I would have preferred if you went, you know, all the way. 
Dude, literally every other unit is an I unit. Besides besides the, the rainbow, which is going to be Las Vegas Meliodas. I can't even believe every other unit is an I. You know why? Every other unit is, an, is Silva is an I because it took all that luck and put it into the diamond that's going to be right here. Ooh, okay. I'll take a bond. I actually like this blue bond. He's pretty beast. I've been using him quite a bit. Here he goes. What was I just using him? Which event? I'm pulling like really good units right now. I'm pulling all units that I need. This is great. Oh, I can't remember which event I was just using him on. Garbage. But he's pretty badass. Here we go. 243. Here we go. Las Vegas Meliodas, dupe number three. Here we go. Oh, technically dupe number two, special attack increase. Okay, here we go. Here we go. What's it gonna be? This one, I'm not sure. This one, feel like it could, it could go either way. I mean, he's still in his base form. We're getting knocked back. There's no, there's no Escanor in sight. So, nope. Right, let's go again. We still got plenty of summons to go. We still got plenty. Oh look, we got some pork chops in this summon. Let's knock that hand back. Thank you very much. There should be a special summon, summon animation when the skinny Albion pops out. And then you automatically know you're gonna pull like three SSS or something crazy. Should be like a a super special summoning event that happens super rare like weeks rewind time or something like that that would be pretty badass yeah you know, i'm a little disappointed we haven't gotten a double ssi in a while i sure as heck haven't seen one even when i did my derriere summons off camera there was no double ssis coming out of that banner for me but that's okay we only need to pull the lv melee L V Melly on the next summon. Here we go. I think it's the next one. Nope. We're getting close though. Taizo looks pretty cool when you fully awaken him. He has like a taiga head. I don't know if you guys have all done that yet. Cause I got almost all of my eye units up to the UI level. It's just taking a long ass time. Ooh. Alright, Boar Hat Tavern Master Meliotis is letting us know that he's about to come out. L V Meliotis. Here we go. Woo. Another bond. Wow, it's like a bond banner. Wow, so in the next one after him was another Boar Hat Tavern Meliodas. That's pretty funny. Oh, there's a loyalty reward, and I pull friggin' what's his face? I forgot his name. Wait, is that the one? Wait, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Why can't I remember his name? Is that what I was supposed to pull? Or was that like a random one? I think that was random. Is that the one I needed? It was the one I needed! Oh, that's beast mode! Hell yeah! Oh yeah. Monspeed. There we go. That's the one I needed because I already have the other Monspeed. His name is cool. There we go. Look at that right there. I told you. Now I have both mon speeds. Oh, that was awesome. But look at all the look at all the units I'm missing. I'm missing quite a few right now. Still missing Red King, Red Deanne, Derriere. Uh, view later, bro. I'm summoning right now. I'm summoning. Dude, that was sick! Oh, that was unexpected mon speed! It was really terrible. Well, I don't want to give too much away, but in the latest season of Seven Deadly, Seven Deadly Sins, I felt really bad what happened to him. We'll just leave it at that. Especially for Derriere, because she was all messed up from it. Derriere. I feel like this is going to be a skip banner. I mean, a skip... Ooh, breaking in the middle. A skip summon. Yeah, I had a good feeling. 
Come on, Escanor. Let's go, man. Let's go, Escanor. You know it. It's your time to shine. Ah, oh, we got sticky again. Nope, we're not knocking that hand back. We're just picking it up. I feel like this is going to be another skip. But that's okay, because we still get a few summons left. Breaking in the middle. Breaking in the middle. And nothing. I told you. I have I have the the third eye of truth opened up on these gotcha games, man. All right, last two summons. Here we go. Where's my boy Eskinor? Nope. Picking the hand up. All right. Can we save it? Maybe. Most likely not. <laughs> oh, what? What? All right. Spoke too soon. Better not be another bond, though. We, we, we've left the bond train, bro. Like, we're done. We've pulled two bonds. We don't need another one. We're good. Let's keep moving. Ruin. Here we go, Lost Vein Billy. Oh, yeah, it's Fraudrin. Dude, we pulled Fraudrin and Lost Vein Meliodas. That looks pretty beast. I'd actually prefer him in this costume over his UI uh, costume because he looks like a badass. Well, there's no more SSIs in there. That's how you do it, boys. That's how you pull both in one video. All right, the final summon. Put those hands in the air. Raise that spirit bomb luck because we are about to do the most epic summon right now. Here we go. You saw it. We got the st cross out, cross the sky stars. We got full transformation Meliodas. We just pulled Proudrin. Here comes two Lost Vein Meliodases in one summon. The game's about to implode. I'm about to win seven deadly sins. Like, there's no, no, there'll be nothing else for me to do with two Lost Vein Meliodases. All right, let's go nice and slow on these. Now this is how you end a summon video. All right, we'll pull Deanne. Okay, you know, not too bad. Wait, is that the Deanne I need? I think it's the Deanne I need. It might be, which is pretty cool if it is. Because I just told you guys I needed her. But I'd rather pull Lost Bay Meliodas. And Deanne is in love with Meliodas, at least for the better part of Seven Deadly Sins. So... That's just a, a preemptive strike letting us know. LV Melly is coming! Boom! Okay, another Estorosa. Pulling like a ton of good units today. All right, let's see. Oh no, it was Green Deanne. Oh, and there was an Escanor in there too! It was a, it was, there was a fake out in there. I didn't even know it was gonna happen. But it's Green Escanor. Damn it! I don't need green Escanor. I'm so many coins of green Escanor. Let's go take a look at our loot real quick. There's your boy, Fraldrin. All right, let's go to LV Melly. Let's awaken that move by one. All right. Awesome. Now, let's go find... I think Deanne is done. I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure Deanne is... Fully maxed out. Where is she? I think she's towards the top. There she is. Yeah, her ultimate move is already her already maxed out. Uh, we pulled blue bond. Where's my blue bond? It's not that one. Go away. I'm doing stuff. God damn. Uh, yep, this one right here. So we can raise him up to super attack three, which is pretty good. There we go. All right, and now let's go, let's just go to the coin shop real quick. Shop, coin shop, I wanna see how many, I have 38 tokens. See, like I'm on the fence about buying this Escanor. Here's all the tokens I have. 
We pulled two red Esterosas. I'm going to use those. I got two green Escanors still ready to go. Quite a bit. Quite a bit of coins that I don't need. But I'm going to wait. Because I pull a lot of Escanors. I'm going to wait. Let's see. Is there anything else we can summon on real quick? Nope. 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 Ooh. We got one fairy ticket. Let's see if we get lucky on that. Might as well, right? But I'm going right to the skip. Nope, got a green DN. And that's it. Oh, that was a pretty good summon video, guys. We got two Lost Fade Meliodas. We pulled Fraudrin. We pulled two Bonds. And, I mean, it was just epic. It's always epic here. If you guys enjoyed my videos and you want to make sure you don't miss my live stream of Dokkan tonight, make sure you tap that notification bell. We're just going to be doing some of the new events, uh, the virtual Dokkan Clash uh boss rush you know and then obviously some summons so make sure you don't miss it i'll see you then until then i got stuff to do later guys